A new pest is moving through Maryland, targeting leeks, garlic, and onions. The allium leaf miner is an invasive fly that feeds on plants in the allium family. This damage can introduce pathogens that can lead to rotten bulbs. The pest also stunts growth, causing twisted, deformed shoots. Fly emergence first occurs in early spring, generally March or April. The flies will mate and search for nearby allium plants. Females will pierce the stalks of leaves with their ovipositor, creating characteristic rows of punctures. This is the first visible sign of infestation. Males and females will feed on the exuding sap of these puncture marks. Then, the female will lay eggs within the holes. The eggs will hatch into maggots that tunnel down the length of the stalk, feeding on plant tissue. As the onions develop, so do the larvae. Towards the end of the spring growing season, they can be found at the base of the plant. You may have to pull back a few layers to find the yellow larva. Soon they will pupate and wait out the summer. Pupa are small, brown, and oblong. The flies emerge around September to cycle through their life stages once again in the fall. The final pupation will overwinter and emerge the following spring. There are a variety of chemical treatments for this pest, but the safest and most effective strategy is to cover your plants during the fly's emergence period. Row covers are made from translucent, white, breathable fabric that rests over hoops in the ground. They will protect uninfected gardens from flying adults. Be sure to place them on your garden during both the spring, late February to May, and autumn, late August to November. However, if your garden is already infested, row covers will be unhelpful as the flies could become trapped. If plants have already shown signs of damage, the best solution is to cut your losses and remove your crop. Some alliums, like onions, may still be tasty, harvested early. Then, cover your soil with a tarp. We call this solarization, as it will cook the soil to kill any pupating flies. You can remove the tarp at the end of the adult's flight period in November. If you decide to do a fall allium planting, try sowing in a different bed the year of the infestation. Solarization, row covers, and crop rotation should reduce the impact of this pest and allow for abundant allium harvest in the future.